Hey viewers, if you would like to get two soon trending news videos, please subscribe to our channel, Daily Bulletin News, and stay with us. On this episode of Days of Our Lives, Melinda persuades Sloane to commit a terrible deed, Nicole and EJ worry about their missing child, and Stefan issues a warning to Polina. Rafe enters Joda's hospital room in Salem today and discovers she is vanished. When Leave hears a noise in the park, Jada appears and informs him that he is being taken into custody. When he attempts to talk himself out of it, Jada tells him that nothing is misunderstood. When he attempts to flee, he runs straight into Ref. Back at the police station, Rafe shouts accolades to Dimitri while handcuffing Leo to the chair. Leo declines to answer their questions about where his boo is. He maintains that by saving a woman in distress and her child, he and Dimitri are heroes. Jada and Rafe ask him to elaborate. Leo provides more details, stating that he departed as soon as Eric showed up and that Dimitri took the infant to the hospital. I'm sure he's still there, watching over the little guy with him. Nicole and her child must be all right, according to Leo. I've never seen a cuter little human. When Leo informs Dimitri that he has been arrested, the latter picks up and becomes frightened. Tate comforts Holly as she worries about her mother over in the Dimera mansion. Just before EJ enters, they give each other a hug and look into each other's eyes. When Holly tells him she forgot to use the location finder on her phone, EJ loses it. Tate claims that they were advised to stay put and that Eric is out looking for Nicole after being called a juvenile delinquent for trying to stand up to EJ. EJ leaves, leaving the teenagers to worry even more. He wonders if it was just him or were they going to kiss until EJ spoiled it all, as she thanks him for being there. Are you serious at this moment? You're only interested in getting some after my pregnant mother goes missing, is that right? She orders him to get the heck out, labeling him a disgusting womanizer. He retracts his apology for misjudging the situation and retreats with a sigh. Nicole tells Eric that Dimitri is the baby's father when she is still by the side of the road, flashing back to Leo and Dimitri assisting her in giving birth. Her child was a male. Eric, oh my god, my son is with Dimitri. She explains to him that Dimitri fled with just the baby because he was afraid to move her. At that point, she realizes Eric doesn't trust Dimitri and becomes anxious. Next, there's another flashback to the previous day. Nicole loses it even more when she realizes that Leo is also untrustworthy. To inform Rife that the fugitives have his and Nicole's baby, Eric gives him a call. However, there's no cell coverage. EJ appears, looking foolishly happy that he has a son, while Eric reassures her that she and her infant son will receive the assistance they require. When EJ wonders where their son is, Nicole and he are both ecstatic as he rushes to her side. Nobody says anything, and then EJ asks for clarification. Nicole demands that he get up, and EJ tells Eric to go take care of his own wife after he catches up. I'll handle it on my own. In her apartment, Sloane informs Melinda that things have changed. It's time to tell Eric the truth. But Dimitri is ready to knock with Nicole's infant just as she opens the door to depart. Due to their fame, they are able to identify one another— and Dimitri declares he needs Sloane's assistance. Dimitri is prepared to run since he believes Melinda is still the DA, and she demands to know whose baby it is. They naturally do a double take when he informs them the baby is EJ's after reassuring them. Dimitri tells them what transpired. He tried to head to the hospital, but the police presence was overwhelming. He hurried to Sloane, knowing she was adept at bailing dodgy characters out of sticky situations. However, as Sloan remarked, yes, but not in this way. Melinda catches him before he can run off again and advises him to calm down because he was trying to do the right thing. You are in the proper place. She motions for Sloan to accompany her and instructs Dimitri to leave the child with them. They will handle things from there. He gives Sloan the baby and leaves. Melinda has different ideas, but she wants to call the cops. She is not interested in the hospital or the police. This child might be the blessing you've been waiting for.